Okay. Whoa. Thank you. I really appreciate it. Mm, mm, mm. Listen, you guys. Good morning. Good afternoon. Good evening. Welcome, welcome, welcome to the mental house with me, your host, Khadija. I'm gonna ask a question because I'm gonna I'm gonna deal with this later. Y'all let me know if we should deal with this um in a live stream or if you interested in participating in a live stream. Um all you gotta do is put a comment in the um comment section because I, I, I hate to have these uh, live streams and I see people listening and nobody uh, comments. So I haven't had one in a while. And um, I have hooked up the phone lines. So I just want to hear from you so we can interact a little bit because I got some really serious issues that I want to talk about and get y'all opinion on it. Because in my opinion, this is the main thing I want to talk about. Do you think people have gotten crazier after the COVID, after the pandemic? Do you think that, or has it been this way all the time And, and from some of y'all perspective? Because I've been around a while. I ain't never seen nothing this people this crazy in all my life. And I know that with a child's heart, you can see a lot of things, the good and everything. And I, I never want to lose sight of that. But at the end of the day, I'm seeing some stuff and hearing some stuff and even watching things that I can't believe exists. The madness. The cult-like uh, behavior. Um, the Karens. The Kens. What the hell is really going on with y'all asses? I mean, I want to know. And if y'all want to talk about it, we can. Otherwise, I'll just keep doing this commentary. Um, Because this article came from uh, the Daily Mail. And they said, J.P. Morgan's uh, 10 shocking things that's supposed to happen in 2024. Number one, that Biden is going to pull out the presidential race over poor health. Rolling blackouts will hit cities. And driverless cars boycott it. You better boycott. Don't let them put you in no car that's not man. You're going to drive your ass right off the damn cliff. And then tell my oops. Don't do it. Don't get so enamored with what the devil rolls out for you that's new. And you are so... Uh, like I said, enamored with having the first this or being the first one with that or those kind of spirits get your ass hurt. I often wonder what my grandma would say right now if she could see the internet. I often wonder. Because I know when I did talk to one of her older friends before she passed away, she said, that's, that's nothing but dancing with the devil. She didn't even understand what the hell was going on. She said, that, I don't know, baby, but that's dancing with the devil. <laughs> I think about those things sometimes in my quiet moments. Anyway, they said Joe Biden, uh, they, they shocking revelations that he's going to pull out. I think he's too egotistical to pull out the damn uh, race. If you ask me. Um, but the 10 things um, is hmm, uh, the U.S. dollar remains stable. Uh, the Department of Justice um, win a big antitrust case and FTC. Of course, I just said Biden, President Biden, withdraws from November election. Who the hell would you um, even nom- listen to on a ticket from the Democratic Party? I personally, I still 
rolling with Marianne Williamson all the way. All the way. If there was any way that I could insert her in there, I have confidence that she would put the right people behind her, that everybody would get something. But for some people, equality looked like oppression, so they definitely wouldn't vote for her. <laughs> okay? But I believe that um, a mind, a heart like that can lead the world stage, can deal with, uh, devils on all levels. Anyway, number four is the driverless car backlash is coming. Because there's too much stuff going on with the robots attacking people and going nuts and, uh, you know, driverless cars driving around and around and around and, and, and locking the people inside of them. Yeah, you you gonna have some problems with backlash. It's coming. Broadly syndicated loan losses rise above private credit losses for the first time. Argentine dollarization will fall if implemented. Now, now don't forget, this is not my idea. This is what um. Uh uh. J.P. Morgan's 10 most shocking things of 24. Not Khadija's. Um, Russian invasion of Ukraine drags on with no ceasefire in 2024. Uh-huh. I hope they don't send no more our damn tax dollars over there or to Israel. Because I ain't with it. And despite storm clouds over U.S. regional banks, their stocks will do well. And due to retirement of dispatchable power, major cities will face electricity outages and or natural gas outages. Oh, Lord. And I live up here by Canada. All of us going to be froze. Researchers will complete work on an inhaled COVID vaccine. Did you hear that? Researchers will complete work on an inhaled COVID vaccine. Y'all going y'all interested in sniffing it? Donald Trump has a 4 point lead over Joe Biden. He's at 40%. Joe Biden is at 36%. This is disgusting. RFK Jr. is at 4%, and he don't need to be nowhere. Um, after hearing him, I was like, this dude is whack. Um, Cornell West is at 1%. Trump has taken, overtaken Biden in head-to-head -head matchups since June. Freaking disgusting. I um I don't know for health reasons or whatever, but maybe Joe Biden should step down right now and give other people a chance because I'm done with his lying ass anyway. Doesn't mean I feel that I can get some things done through a Republican Party. It's not that I feel that way. I believe in taking the uh, least the ideas that are most aligned with mine and putting pressure on them, making them do what they what they saying on paper. Okay, that's 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 my belief. Not running and trying to join somebody else that already have proven to you that they don't give a damn about your ass. Anytime you knock down the civil rights. Uh, <coughs> investigation in a place like America you already know you in for trouble so uh, you know we're not even gonna go there anyway what y'all think about the um these 10 these 10 shocking revelations and let me know if you want to talk about some things
I'm very open. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> let me know what you think, okay? If you like what you hear, please like, subscribe, and share the channel. I'll see you in the next video.